Hey guys, today I have an October favorites for you. I tried a lot of great products this month that I'm so excited to share with you guys. I tried a variety of things from low ends to high ends and even some Korean products. So let's get started. The first thing is this NYX eye marker and this is called the Super Skinny Eye Marker. There is also one that was very thick but I chose this one because I do draw my eyeliners very thin and I wanted to use this to draw like false lashes on the bottom. So this is called the Carbon Black. I really really like this. It's super pigmented. It glides on so easily. The price is great and unlike the liquid liners, it doesn't peel or start cracking, so I really like this. After a few seconds, it will be dry. The second thing is this blotting tissue paper, and this is the 24-7 that I got from Ulta. This is the unpowdered and unscented one. I do tend to break out whenever I do use the ones that have powder on it because my face is very sensitive. So I got the natural sensitive skin one. I love the size of the paper. It's just enough to blot my whole entire face. And it's the paper based one which I like. The third thing is this Wet n Wild Eyeliner Pencil. This can also be used as a brow pencil. And this is the color in 660A and it's called the Bronze. And it was only 99 cents. The reason why I bought this is because I wanted to use it to line on my eyebrows for like future tutorials um, that I will be doing soon. Next is this Emprani eyeshadow. Emprani is a Korean cosmetic brand, which I love. Um, if you guys have watched my New York City haul video, I purchased this eyeshadow, but in like a white silver color. I love this so much, so I went ahead and bought a different one. This is the Shine Peach number no. three. So let me swatch it for you. I bought another lipstick from NYX and this is the number 576 Frosted Flakes. It's a very pretty nude color. I'm not sure if you can really see it, but if I put it on my lips, you will be able to tell. A lot of nude lipsticks, it kind of washes me out um, and I look kind of sick. But for some reason, this color um, it looks really good on me. It looks very good with my skin tone color. And I guess it has like a peachy tone to it whenever you apply it on your lips. It's very, very pretty. The next thing is this Nivea hand lotion. Whenever the weather starts getting cold, my hands get so, so dry, like to the point where my knuckles start cracking and start bleeding. Um, I've tried a lot of different things to help it, like Vaseline and four different type of hand lotions, but nothing seemed to help except this. This smells so good and it leaves my hands moisturized and so soft throughout the whole day. If you guys are not currently using a hand cream, I highly, highly recommend this one. The next thing is this Neutrogena Makeup Remover. Um, if you guys watched my daily skincare routine video, I showed you that I remove all my face makeup with my toner. Well, like since the weather is getting colder um, and my skin gets more dry in the winter time, I noticed that the toner is drying out my face even more. So I went ahead and bought a separate makeup remover. And I heard a lot of great things about this product. A lot of my friends use it, so I went ahead and um, bought one myself. There are 21 sheets in here and it's very, very moist and all you have to do is just wipe it across your face until all the makeup is gone. Um, so the swatches that I did, I'm going to remove it with this. All gone. The next thing that I got is this MAC Empty Palette and this is the one that holds 15. There's also one that holds um, 4. So this is how it looks. I have so many individual MAC eyeshadows um, just all piled up in one container so it takes me forever to look for a certain color. But now I can depot all of them and just stick it in one palette. 
One thing good about having a palette like this is that the um, refill eyeshadows that fit exactly into these palettes cost only $11.50, whereas the um, individual eyeshadows in the container cost like $14.50. So you will be saving a lot of money. I went to Mecca a few days ago and the first thing that I noticed was their new um, winter holiday collection products. And um, their products are all so, so gorgeous. They're all shimmery and glittery. I did pick up one eyeshadow. This is a mineralized eyeshadow called the Fresh Ice. It has like three colors mixed in it. Like I see some pink, white, and like silver. But when you apply it, it looks just white. I bought this Clio eyeshadow. Um, Clio is a Korean cosmetic brand, very well known because of Ihori. She's the face of the company. It has two different colors in here. And this is the color in number 18, Pink Choco. It has two different shades in here. It's very, very pretty. It has like a peachy pink color and a taupe color. These colors will look great for the fall and winter. I will be doing a tutorial on them soon. So I'm going to swatch them for you really quick. So that was all for my October favorites. For more detailed information and pictures on any of the products mentioned in this video, please visit beautifyme.com. For more monthly favorites, please subscribe up there for more, like down there, and I will talk to you guys later.